Astralis on their last legs at the moment. Are they to be toppled here though? Glaive waiting anxiously there by Popdog. One of the few players on the team with an actual rifle in the most important rounds. And Gambit are really making them sweat here, slowing down the pace. The focus there, can you imagine? The focus, it looks like Gambit have decided though that it is time to start to make the move because here they go into a he knows he's there, Adren, but can he do anything about it? Dozier, Adren, CT's falling to the flames, falling to the bullets, cold steel. A minute on the clock, the bomb has to get retrieved. Zipex keeps his team in it. A two versus three device, still over towards Ivy, still with the scout, but the bomb's heading towards B. And look how deep Hobbit is. He's gonna be a nasty surprise for these CTs. What are they gonna do right now? Hobbit though, he still could actually get caught in the back it seems, but it looks like they don't even know that it's gonna be B. They thought perhaps they were going back to A. Device has to clutch one versus three with just the scouts. A trend mode and Hobbit with all the time in the world to position. Hobbit sitting there in connector, a dangerous position. Device knows to look out for it, misses the flick shot and Garvin have done the unthinkable. They will be in the major finals. A massive, massive result from Gambit. That is quite the scalp, quite the skull to put on your mantelpiece. But I know Gambit are not done yet. They are the first team to make their way into the crack of major finals. A massive result from them going all the way versus Astralis down to the wire. can only imagine what you said to his team using the round as a tactical timeout, making all the difference. The support for Kazakhstan is there. This international team with a humongous result, perhaps the biggest of their careers as a team together so far. It's insane the difference, isn't it, after he had that chat. A team that looks like they were struggling to a team that was possessed by some unbelievable confidence just storming out of every single choke point to take the bomb site in the most convincing way that is an incredible way to put yourself in sir scoots down the stage i am with a very shaky but very happy adrian how's it feel incredible i feel i don't know no words thank you thank you guys so you tweeted earlier in the week that your team had helped you get to the playoffs and that you needed to step up. You obviously stepped up, but let's talk a little about map one. You beat Astralis on overpass. Mo, 33 kills, played out of his mind. Uh, I don't know what happened. He played, I think, his best game ever. So, uh, I don't know. I don't have a Sorry. <laughs> Good time for the best game ever. Let's talk about the third map. Obviously, it's very, very close in that first half. Unfortunately, Glaive does a team kill. Changes the momentum of that last round, or last two rounds, I should say. Kind of gives you a little bit of more momentum and confidence going into that second half. Yeah, we feel, we feel confidence again after that. We, we knew that they nervous as well, so we are like, we got this. And we knew that we can win this. We, start, we started to believe. Now here's the last big important question. Immortals, Virtus Pro are about to play, right? You're already in the finals. You're really close to that trophy. You want to beat VP here? Yeah, we won, definitely, yeah. <laughs> he wants to play the best, right? Yeah, right. We want Virtus Pro in the final. All right. Good luck to you. Paul, back to you at the desk.